King of Macedonia. When Alexander was still just a teen, he became a soldier. A year later, Alexander helped his father defeat the armies of Thebes and Athens, Greek city-states. The relationship between father and son fell apart. King Philip II married a princess named Cleopatra, Eurydice, and forced Alexander's mother, Olympia, to leave. Alexander and Olympia fled Macedonia and stayed with her family. In 336 BC, Alexander's sister married a king. During a festival afterward, King Philip II was murdered. Alexander was 19 years old at the time. After his father's death, Alexander decided to become king any way that he could. He gained the support of a Macedonian army. It proclaimed Alexander the king and helped him kill anyone else who wanted to be king. Olympia helped her son by killing the daughter of King Philip and Cleopatra. The southern Greek state celebrated King Philip II's death and tried to break free from Macedonia. Campaigns and Conquests Alexander received the news that Thebes, a Greek city-state, had forced out the Macedonian soldiers. Alexander did not want the other city-states to rebel and marched his huge army south all the way to the tip of Greece. He had 3,000 horsemen and 30,000 soldiers. Alexander and his army destroyed Thebes. He wanted to send a message to other cities not to rebel. The other Greek city-states paid attention and became allies of the Macedonian Empire or stayed out of the conflict. Alexander defeated King Darius III of Persia twice. Darius fled and Alexander declared himself the king of Persia. Next, he won Egypt, which gave up without fighting. He created the city of Alexandria and it became a center for Greek arts, ideas, and business. Alexander next conquered Eastern Iran. After capturing the prince, Alexander married the prince's daughter, Roxana. He also defeated India. When Alexander was about 31, he reached the city of Susa in Persia. He was worried that he would be overthrown as the leader. He also wanted to get more soldiers. He commanded many Macedonians to marry Persian princesses. Alexander hired tens of thousands of Persian soldiers for his army and then fired many Macedonian soldiers. This angered the soldiers. They spoke badly about Alexander's new troops and complained that he was becoming too Persian. This map is showing the expansion of Alexander's empire. Just to review, Macedonia and Greece were over here and anything highlighted in green is the land that Alexander conquered. It is a massive amount of land. All the way from Egypt into Persia, Bactria to India. His death. Alexander died on June 13th, 323 BC in Babylonia, which is now in Iraq. He had malaria, which is a disease. He was just 32 years old. Roxana gave birth to his son a few months later. After Alexander died, his empire collapsed. The nations in it fought for power. Over time, the arts and ideas of Greece and Asia mixed and thrived. It was a gift that Alexander gave to the world.